How's it going today? Welcome to Life of Belsif. I'm your host, Belsif. Today on the Belsif Show, we're going to pack up here. we got to take the old Chevy Silverado out to Plug Ones and get an oil guard done. So I might take you along for the ride if you want to go. It's up to you, but let's see what happens. I'm going to wait for Mike. Mike's coming out with me. He's got one to get oiled too. And then next weekend, we're going to try to get Wifey Pooh's car out to get oiled. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys oil your cars and girls. Do you oil your car or not? What's really going on? Let me know. That's what we're doing today. Hopefully the rain holds off. It looks like it's going to rain. It's not supposed to until later on. So we got to be out there for 3.30. It's now 1 o'clock. So we got a little bit of time to wait yet. But we're going to get out there soon. So come on with me for the ride if you want. We're ready to go. Just waiting for a buddy to show up. Because he's getting an oil guard done too. Mike, you know him. I already told you who's going. We're waiting here. And then we're going to roll out. Got him. Look at this guy scrapping. Just cocking everybody right over. What's really going on? Jim? <laughs> oh, great. Going straight, Jeff. Well, here we go. There's a little bit of a sign missing right there. Rolling into Inwood, aka Plug One. Why wouldn't we? It's been a minute since I got the old Silverado oil guarded here. So we'll have to see how good of a job he does. I'm pretty sure he's gonna do a decent job. Inquiring minds wanna know. Captain? Wonder if he's ready for me. Oh, he's got one still on the hoist. Come on! Frig! My point was three o'clock. Oh, yeah. Oh, gonna wait for another one? No, that's the same truck. I know. No. Oh, you took your mask off. I'm gonna give you an old guard shout out, but you took your mask off. Ha <laughs> ha. How you doing? Uh, you son of a bitch, you can you hold one of these up here? I'm getting the freaking best oil guard there is around, boys. She falls, she falls right in, Jim. You almost had her perfect when you started veering terrible. Well, you know. Let's try to get the camera working. It's more important, isn't it? Yeah. So it's been a couple years since I got this oil guarded. Probably rusted out, bud. Probably it was z barted so you know z bart goes around the frame and seals the rust in. Yeah. So it flakes every year. So every oh, time oh. I power wash under there, I get chunks. So I'll have to see what it looks like. I was doing it a couple years ago too. I know you were. No. But of course you took it to Z-Bart. No. no, I didn't. It was Z-Bart before oh, I Oh, I apologize. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I started, I started accusing. Yeah. It's dry. It's not shitty, but it's dry. She'll be mint. How's it look under there? Dry it. Yep, yeah, pretty dry. Need to drink.
Was it top here you did? Yeah. Yeah, it's one of those ones. Tell me where to go. Because you got to wiggle it to the and turn it. The brake there is good. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, it's going to move and you probably try to tighten it too. Yeah, that too. I hate these fucking numbers. The one just panned out, that's it, eh? Yeah, no worries. Here's your over here. Cap. Sure. Frickin' whatever that is. Yeah. Where did you get that now? Did you, did you have it? That was on it. I brought it next to because it turns inside. I wasn't sure if it's going to tighten the lock later yeah. or not. You need something to clean on, but I don't want to lock it. Getting locked in here. You should spray it. Cool. There we go. Well, there we go. We got all guarded and I literally left my window down on the passenger side. So it is covered in friggin' oil. Thanks, Chris, for giving an oil guard. Appreciate it. It should slow down the old Rusterooskies on the old rig. Mike behind me got his done. That's all done. Perfect. Friggin' right. Homebound we go. Well, we made her back. We had something to eat. It's starting to spit rain out a little bit, so I can't go for my walk tonight. Well, I could, but I'm not gonna. Instead, it's a little cooler out, so I'm gonna get the fire going. I got all my food all over myself. Anybody else do that when they eat? And get themselves covered in food? Don't lie to me. Oh, we still gotta get doing something with that. At least that's winterized now, so now we can get on that someday. But I got a bunch of new wood that I get delivered. And let me tell you what, those dogs are annoying. This wood right here burns awesome. Nice and seasoned. Ah, so we did pretty good today. We got the truck oiled. We got some other little shit done around the house and Bob's your uncle. So there you go. What do you think of that video? Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notification. I'm gonna throw this wood on the fire. And we'll see you on the next one.